Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of the Bullet Survival Games. Today we are here on the map Docs V1. And uh, I reached 100 subscribers, pack will be in the description. It's called 3, um, because in my mind it's the third decent PvP pack I've made. Like, obviously I've made a lot, but by today's standards, for what I think a PvP pack should be, all, none of my other ones hold up at all. Um, Sam Wise Gamgee's in this game. He's an old player. He's in my guild. We're gonna be crushing his hopes and dreams, though. Uh, so one thing they might notice is this video is in 720p. I know it's kind of weird to do a pack release, the 720p video, because you think you'd want the highest quality. Um, well, you see, it's probably true. Uh, however, I want to try recording with 720p, and I want to know what you guys think, because um, it feels really smooth to record like this, because obviously it's a lot less hard on my computer. Um, and yeah, just tell me what you guys think. If you don't mind, then I'll keep doing this. Obviously, the mouse is a little bit bigger, um, which it looks more clumsy. Obviously, it isn't. To me, it's just the same size. I'm just as not clumsy as I was before. Um, it just it looks bigger. And then um, the uh, video's going to be more, cra more grainy. Uh, 720p, I don't think, is really going to bother anybody who doesn't watch in full screen, though. Uh, even if they watch in the um, bigger than... Not full screen, but still not full screen. I don't know what it's actually called. Um, theater mode. Even if people watch in theater mode, um, I don't think it'll be that big a deal. So, yeah, just tell me what you guys think. It feels super smooth. I'll definitely be able to PvP a lot better with it, I think. So, yeah. I can PvP pretty good, but recording in 1080, so just tell me what you guys think. Um, but yeah, I've been messing around with recording settings a lot, because I see people's videos, and they look way smoother. And I think, I don't even know why, because I record videos in 60 frames, and I don't know, they don't look as smooth as I'd like them to, even though I don't get any lag spikes or frame drops or anything. Um, not in 720p, anyway. So I really don't know, but yeah, also, there's this thing up here in the corner, which I don't know how to get rid of. Like, yeah, I'm recording in action, I have the option enabled to hide it, but it's not hidden. So, I don't really know, um, I'll have to, oh, I'll get the D, um, I will have to try and fix that, however I can, uh, I'll probably just put, like, an overlay saying, like, subscribe, which is what I used to have, because I had a blackboard overlay in the bottom of the, in the top, for the little things, because I could only record in windowed mode, um, I still play in windowed mode because you can tap out a lot easier, and sometimes I talk to people on like Slack while I'm playing, and so I still be able to tap out super easily. I still be able to see my game in the background, which lets me see things like um, how long till the game starts and such, which is really nice. Um, dang, we are on fire with our rods today. Like I've actually been doing really good with my rotting today. You guys proud of me, guys? I've been doing really good with my wadding. My mommy says I'm gonna be a PvP god. Alright, uh, I'm gonna get a bow. Oh, whoopsie daisies. Hello there. Who are you? Okay, so there's Sam, who's pigman something. He might be X, I don't know. drinking. Pup got him. The regen's out, might have to drink them. <laughs> uh, the speed out. You might not have realized it was me, um, but we got him, like I said. Um, he doesn't actually play too much Blitz anymore. And I didn't know he was um, Pigman X. Well, that's what Sky Wars will do to you, man. Playing way too much of that game. Wrong pot. You okay. have slow three pots though, so. So 3 is a bit good, as it turns out. Hey, get over here. 
Uh, okay. Second game, guys. Hello, everybody. We're here in the second game. I'm not gonna continue on with that cringe any longer. Um, yeah, I lost the last game to a 40k plus kill guy toggling. That's fun. Um, but yeah, if you guys want to stick around to the end of the video, I'll be doing a uh, little showcase on the Ryan Aiden map edit thing. Um, if you want to see anything in more detail, I don't really have too much. I guess it's a pretty simplistic pack right now, but I'm hoping to add more in the future. Um, so consider this like a V1 release more than like a final release. I'll be releasing more in the future, probably like 150 um, and so on. I'll be releasing more edits, uh, if I ever reach 150 that is. Actually, I need those boots. Rip. Um, there we go, iron boots. But uh, yeah, um, these are hyped for the pack release. I am I'm ready to get it released. I'm, I'm excited that I've actually released the pack at 100. I was patient and I actually released it at 100 instead of just releasing it earlier because I felt like it. Because so many people were asking. Um, I might also make a private pack at some point that I don't release, at least not for a very long time. Um, I don't know. We'll see. Uh, I've actually been really liking the Huawei pack though, as well. I pretty much play with this and the uh, pack that Huawei released because Huawei is just, he has a good track record when it comes to packs, you know? He has a good uh, portfolio of very widely used packs. How about you give me that kill so that I get the regen buff? Combo you. Get your one healing potion. Oh boy. You. You. I don't like you. Because I don't know if you're laggy or what, but you always look fishy as balls. I don't know. I'll fight though, if you wanna. He's in, uh, Pally 10, though, so... Just, uh, heal pot. I really need... Really need a rod. Wow. Uh, okay, he just did three hearts in one crit. I mean, I guess it actually does make sense, considering the fact that he's using an iron sword, but oh, I don't want to... I'm just getting pinned by all these people who are so blatantly targeting me. Okay, kill the other guy. Kill Zinara. There we go. No, look at you. You're just waiting in the back. Not gonna do that. Too smart for that, man. It just ain't happening. If I can get this guy far away, I'll fight him 100%. I'm not gonna fight when there's a Pally 10 waiting to be clean me up. No, 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 no. Karma. Alright, let's go, mate. Let's go right now. Let's go. Rod, there we go. Oh man, over here. Get out. Get out. Uh, Star's gonna be released. It is. I want that speed though. All right. Sorry about that. That was a Slack notification. Hopefully, it doesn't bother you guys. Be more precise. Hopefully the seven twenty P doesn't bother you guys. I I don't know. It it wouldn't bother me personally, but maybe it bothers you guys. We'll see. We'll take it. It's got knock, fire, and sharp. Pretty well rounded weapon. Combos, get the fire so they can't run, get the sharp for the damage, also fire for the damage. Fire aspect is scary, okay? Fire is one of those things in the survival game scares me, okay? Whether it's a flint and steel, uh, a 
Blaze, a Blaze Axe. I think I just do it a Power Bow crap. <sighs> By the way, there was a revamp thread made, and there was it was suggested to add a stick that had a few uses of Fire Aspect 1. I'm just kind of over here like, why? You're, you're gonna do the same thing to Blaze that, re that these things, these pots right here, did Astro, which is make it useless. Why would you ever run Astro? When you could just run armor and get these from chests. You should you should never run Astro. <laughs> no point in running Astro. At all. Alright, let's chase this guy. Um so yeah, I don't know. I feel like um they need to remove those from chests. The the uh, resist pots or buff Astro in some other way, like giving it either armor potential, like I don't know why they wouldn't just give it like diamond boots. I would play. I, I would pay the kit if it got like diamond boots, and even if it was a st uh, unbreaking stone sword, a stone sword. I feel like that would fix the kit. <laughs> give it those few items. That'll help it out. Um, there you can have the seeds. Enjoy those. More specifically, enjoy my gear. Okay. See this potion? I want you to eat it. No, no, no. Got him. Alright guys, that was an episode of the Blitz Survival Games. Uh, enjoy the pack. Um, I'm gonna head out of Hypixel real quick and show you guys a few things with it. Uh, we have the swords. Diamond. Gold. Wood. Um... All the food stuffs are the same for now, but they will be edited in the future. Uh, particles are... Okay, so... The sharpness particles are this. And then the um, crits are the heart. So, we... That, the little hearts. I'm planning to change these in the future, because they're not... You can't really notice it very well when you're PvPing, so... I'm gonna change in the future, but for now that's what they are. Um, let's see, the armor is all Faithful 32, just because I like the Faithful 32, I like, there's some packs where they change the armor so much, it, it's not really hard to tell what are they have, that's, that's not really the main issue, I just like Faithful 32, especially the chain, I like, I like this chain, but I'll probably, probably edit the armor in one of the future versions, um, I know the ores don't match the stone, but that is intentional, because I want them to blend in enough, which I think they do, but also stand out a little, so you notice them more. They're obviously not, like, you know, highlighted UHC ores, but they still work. Uh, rods are gonna be improved a lot in future versions, for sure. Bows, maybe. I, do, I, I don't know, I just, I, I just like the Faithful Bow, okay? I like the Faithful Bow. I did a feather, because I think feathers look good. Um, if I go game mode zero. Hearts, inventory's clear. Most inventories, any inventory that you need using Blitz, at least, is clear. Um... And, uh, yeah. Hope you guys, uh, enjoy the pack. Sense 3. Um, yeah, see you guys next time. Uh, bye.